So you're sitting down, ready to dive into your favorite Xbox One game or game add-on, only to be greeted by a frustrating error message, 0x803F8007. It's enough to make any gamer's blood boil. But fear not, because today I'm going to show you how to fix this pesky error and get back to gaming in no time. First things first, let's understand what this error actually means. Error 0x803F8007 typically occurs when there's an issue with the licensing or digital rights management DRM of the game or add-on you're trying to play. It could be due to a variety of reasons, such as an expired subscription, a problem with your account, or even a glitch in the system. Now let's get down to business. The first step is to ensure that your Xbox One or Xbox Series XS is connected to the internet. Without a stable internet connection, your console won't be able to verify the licenses required to play the game or add-on, so double-check your Wi-Fi or Ethernet connection and make sure it's working properly. If your internet connection is solid, the next step is to sign out and sign back into your Xbox Live account. Sometimes a simple account refresh can resolve the error. Go to the home screen, navigate to the left, and select your profile. From there, choose Sign Out and wait a few moments. Then, sign back in and try launching the game or add-on again. If signing out and signing back in didn't do the trick, it's time to delve into the depths of your Xbox settings. Head over to the Settings tab on the home screen and select System. From there, choose Console Info and then Reset console. Don't worry, this won't delete any of your games or data. It simply resets your console's settings to their default values. Once the reset is complete, try launching the game or add-on again and see if the error persists. If all else fails, it's time to reach out to Xbox support. They have a team of experts who can guide you through more advanced troubleshooting steps tailored to your specific situation. You can contact them through their website, social media channels, or even via phone. So there you have it, a step-by-step -step guide on how to fix Xbox One or Xbox Series XS errors X83F807.